This is one way to you and Nick O'Neal, man, on this 26th of January 2020. You know, I come to you today, you know, with a heavy heart. You know, uh, I'm not really the type of person that's really a fan of people. I admire some people for their deeds and actions. And sometimes it works. And a number mentality. So I pray to live on. I pray that mama mentality live on. And all the people that's hurting right now. I pray that mama mentality has driven determination to be great. I hope it live on and everybody that was inspired. Kobe Bryant. I watched him play this young man whole career. I remember him taking Brandy to the prom when he was in high school. I cheered him on. I never forget the last game of his career where he scored 60 points on Utah won. On the same night that Golden State got their 73rd win. And his news outside there for 20 years of greatness as a Los Angeles Laker, his 13-year-old daughter. Wow, it's even more tragic. Who died with her great father? Hey, Amen. You know, uh, you know, sometimes you know I be on my grind, man. Might have a good day. You know what I mean? Feel like Kobe Bryant, man. You know what I mean? I got my own championship in day. You know, successful. I don't care what nobody say about a helicopter crash. They killed Kobe Bryant. Bro. Kobe Bryant and his daughter and those nine people, nine or seven other people that was in the helicopter. That's some of this elite sacrificial stuff. I'm sorry. Kobe Bryant. Now, probably outside of Magic Johnson, the most loved Laker in history. You know, when even LeBron, King James, came to the Lakers, you know, his fans, Kobe Bryant fans, Kobe Dean Bryant fans, uh, but they didn't necessarily embrace him. LeBron until Kobe did. With just him the other night playing against his own protege in Philly, Kobe's hometown, where uh, he passed him on all time scoring. The night before that, they played Brooklyn, and I seen him with Bill Clinton. I got a bad feeling in me. When I seen LeBron James with Bill Clinton, Man, I'm fuck with that dude, man. He was that devil, man. Across the lines, man. Coach Bryant's last tweet was to LeBron James. Keep moving forward, my brother. Huh? He called him a brother. He saluted me. I salute Kobe Bryant. And the example that he set for any man. No matter what color or creed, the work ethic of this young man was inspiration. The ability to come back over adversity or injuries to his body and perform at a high level is unmatched. I salute Kobe Bryant on this day of death on the 26th, January 2020. And I shed a tear. With all his loved ones right now. Praying that we understand that we lost a great man to not just for basketball, but a man. God bless your heart. Hope we find Lord have mercy on his soul. I pray that you let him into your kingdom, Father God. And I pray that, that I see him again. When I get on the other side, I salute you, Kobe Bryant, man. I'm gonna love you, Bob.